Thank you. All right, so let's talk about what chords to add to the melody. So as you can see, there's some letters on top, right? Letters on top. So I will help you decipher them, but basically they are C major, F major, and G major. They are all one, four, and five chords, basically. There's a D minor, D M, like this. I will tell you how to spell them, okay? So in so as you see, there's a C on top of this note, right? So all you need to do is just press Shift C E G, and then the next one is G slash C. Now ignore the slash something. Only pretend that the the letter on the left is the actual chord. Okay, ignore the letter on the right. So G in my slideshow, I will tell you it's called it's actually G B D. Okay, and then the third chord is actually F. So I would spell F A C. It's actually just basically every other note, right? Every other note. Um, but here's the thing though, this F is actually above this, this A here. You can notate it if you want, you don't have to. In this case, I can notate it by changing it into an eighth note here, and dot, and on here, and I can shift F A C. And then the world, this, this world here, okay, is uh, a C chord. So I can actually put, I can delete it, I can put C E G, and that, I can actually move it up, okay, like that, okay. And then world, let me see here. Um, on the right side is actually D minor, right? So D minor, I would actually change this into a uh, quarter note here. Go to the left. D minor, it actually spells D, F, A. Okay. And then Lord is C, E, G. And then is as G, B, D. Okay, so let's listen to it and take a look. Okay, so that's actually how it sounds like. So I will give you the spelling of each chord. You can just match the letter to the chord and then input it into your system and see how it sounds like. And we can make some changes after that, okay? We don't have to agree with the, the chords. We can create our own chords uh, later, but we'll, uh, we'll do that after we finish converting this into a piano piece, okay, of, of left hand and right hand, okay?